vlog. I'm sure you can guess where we are. Huh? We're at badminton. Isn't that right? You're so embarrassed. Yeah. We are here. It's Wednesday. We're here to support a friend and watch some others in the B90 and B100 today. But we'll probably spend the day shopping, I think. I've got my new camera that I got for my birthday yesterday. So we're going to test that out. And yeah, take you guys around with us. As much to Michael's display as he's really embarrassed. Aren't you? Nope. <laughs> Just bought a new dog lead so they can stop twisting separate ones up. walking around. There's also some people warming up right down there, I don't know if you can see, or going for a ride in the practice dressage arenas down there. You might go and have a little look at them. And we've just wandered down to the warm-up arenas. Um, can't quite work out who that is. William Fox Pit is just down there. I'm hoping he'll come up and use this arena here. Now we've got Ros Cantor on this side, Laura Collar on that side, William Fox Pitts there, Tom McEwen's, oh he's just gone behind these people, uh, Tom McEwen down there, and an American lady, and another guy who we don't know who he is over there.
چشمه finished day one with the uh, agility. I put maples round in but I'm not putting millies in because it was awful. Um, done a little bit of shopping, been to Eaton Taylor and bought a new tweed coat, jacket, Mike bought some deck shoes, bought a new dog lead. Um, yeah, been quite good. Um, and then just going home now and we'll be back again on Saturday in much less clothes because wellies and jumpers were not needed today. We've been rather warm, although Michael still has his coat done up to the top. But it has been very warm. A very nice day. See you guys on Saturday. It's cross country day. We are just walking the course. Can fit a content for you, and as always, Michael's embarrassed <laughs> and is walking away. Um, yeah, it's really busy already. There's literally hundreds of people, and it's not even nine o'clock yet. This is the ski jump. Big drop on that. And then we go over to the Vicarage V, I think. Fence 14. To the Double little corners over there. I'm not sure how much you can see because the sun's seriously bright. The double little corners over there. And this direct route is to go literally like straight where my camera is pointing essentially. One pretty beefy oxer with a ditch underneath. And you come back and do the Vicarage V. You can see the beagles. Yeah. That one there. Whisper, whisper, come here. Good girl. Nice drop into the water, to the waterfall. Now we have like a cornery ditch thing, which you can either jump, I don't know where my finger is, either jump straight over there or you can go that side, jump the ditch, do a circle and then jump the rail. And then we have the Bickridge V over there, which again, you can either jump straight over the ditch and rail or jump the ditch and then come and jump this one which is way too zoomed in and then go back in that direction I think most people would normally jump the Vicarage V this doesn't look too bad I mean I'm not sure me and Kathy would make it over but we could do it we just got milkshakes from uh, wherever this is now we're going to go one of the shops I think next to go will be New Zealander, Lauren Innes, with Global Vision M. Isn't that the happiest time in the, in the dress out arena? F13. Well, it's certainly huge when he's done the thought of it, but uh, so far today, it's just been a right best dress out. 41.4 there. Oh, Steve. Awesome. Having a lovely ride on HHS Noble Call. Harry Mead goes clear of fence 30. Just two more jumping efforts for him as he finishes the course. Mm. Yes. Total of 48.2. Just started, of course, it's uh, Holly Town and again on uh, Ballot Small Class. Cross country is finished. Now it's time for the doggies to play. Go, go! <laughs> Whoa, that dog had a That's massive a stick. stick. <laughs> Millie's, <laughs> Millie's gone in. Maybe like no, <laughs> stick. Come on, Maple, Millie, come on. Millie! She's in there. Millie! Millie, come! Millie's seen something she's Millie, alive. Millie, Millie, here, yeah, yeah, good girl. Go! guys have enjoyed this vlog i took quite a few photos on my new camera so i'm going to insert 
those here. And please tag, share with people. They can message me um, if they want the original copies. I'm happy to email them. If you recognise anyone, um, I took quite a lot of photos, I think. I actually haven't looked at any of them yet. Um, we had such an amazing time. Sorry, it's a bit of a rubbish vlog, to be honest. Um, I was quite distracted um, by just watching everything rather than doing any vlogging um but hopefully it's really inspired me to get casper there i think i'm going to try and go to bicton three day at the end of the season and see if we can qualify for next year if not um i will do a couple of bees maybe by the end of this season and a couple early next season and see if we can qualify for badminton 2024 um that's the next goal um so yeah i hope you guys have enjoyed this it was such a good time um we went to the pig and whistle and the thatcher's bar on saturday night with loads of friends which was good fun had a good laugh um i really really enjoyed it i highly recommend going to anyone that hasn't um I realise I haven't shown you anything I bought, but to be honest, the only things we bought were a lovely tweed coat from Eaton Taylor. Um, I think I've already said this, actually. Um, the attachment from the D-rings for your air jacket, because mine has gone missing. What else did I buy? Michael bought some deck shoes. I'm sure I bought other things. I can't remember, to be honest. Um, so, yeah. That was pretty much it. Oh, Jemima. I don't know, even know if she's in the vlog, to be honest. She bought a beautiful blazer from Eaton Taylor as well. Um, but we had a really good time. And I hope you guys have enjoyed this vlog. The next vlog will be in a couple of weeks' time. We are going to... The Fairfax and Favour Rocking Horse Trials. Um, I'm also show jumping for my riding club that day. We're doing the 80 because no one wanted to do it, so I said I would. Um, yeah, I might have a vlog before then because I want to do some evening show jumping. Um, if I can get around to organising it, I might have a vlog before then. If not, that'll be the one after this one. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and see you next time.